Hello, everybody. Farley here. And uh, I'm here to do a contest entry for The Rock Scout. Uh, it's a really, really cool channel. Uh, it's got a, a fella by the name of Scott runs the channel. Good people's man. He's got a good taste in music. Shows uh, CDs as well as vinyl. Uh, he likes uh, a little bit of everything. Hard rock to, to heavy metal to thrash. So uh, he's a good channel to watch if you want to get a little bit of variety in your metal. So uh, anyway, really, really good dude, uh, friendly, um, and just an asset to uh, to the vinyl community. And so uh, he's got 250 subscribers, which is awesome, but uh, I know that number will continue to go up. And he's got a few questions for his contest. So I thought I would go through and answer his five questions for his contest. So, first off, he asks, "What's your favorite year in uh, music and why?" And without a doubt, my favorite year is 1988. Uh, and the reason there's so many. Um, let's see. You got Metallica and Justice for All, the greatest album ever made. You got Megadeth, So Far So Good, So What, an underrated gem. Uh, in my opinion, Anthrax, State of Euphoria, uh, Slayer, South of Heaven. Let's see, I've got some more pulled up here. Of course, Forbidden, Forbidden Evil, um, Iron Maiden, Son of a Seventh Son, Operation Mindcrime by Queen Trike, Nuclear Assault, Survive, Napalm Death from Enslavement, Enslavement to Obliteration, Candle Mass, Ancient Dreams. Celtic Frost, Cold Lake, <laughs> Cinderella, Lone Cold Winter, man, Saints Will Conquer by Armored Saint, Blow Up Your Video, which is another underrated album, in my opinion, by ACDC, Face Warning, No Exit, just so many. Uh, I could be here all night listing off Testament the New Order. There's plenty. Uh, but 1988 saw the release of so many great albums that have with, withstood the test of time whether it be thrash or just regular metal or glam uh, those albums still being listened to today of course they took a hit in the 90s with um, the grunge movement but you can't kill good metal man so it's made a definite comeback so 1988 without a doubt the greatest year in uh, music uh, second question was what about a super group he wants you to name your super group so I've got a mostly metal supergroup. The vocals, though, I won't handled by my favorite vocalist, Shane McGowan of the Pogues. Um, One summer evening, drunk to hell, a stubborn, nearly lifeless. An old man in the corner sang, where the water really is grown. Rhythm guitar, Dave Mustaine. Lead guitar, uh, Alex Skolnick from Testament. Bass, Steve Harris of Iron Maiden. And drums, Dave Lombardo, formerly of Slayer, now touring with Suicidal Tendencies. So that is my super group. Favorite movie soundtrack is Michael Kamen's The Iron Giant. Um, it's a classical type uh, arrangement for the soundtrack, and I absolutely uh, love it. It's um, <clears throat> something I go to if I'm like want to calm down or um, you know uh, just chill. So I'll listen to that soundtrack. My favorite uh, musical collaboration would be uh, Anthrax with Public Enemy. When they did Bring the Noise, I absolutely loved that song. And I was a big fan of the period in metal when um, rap and metal kind of crossed paths there, late 80s, uh, going into the 90s, uh, the Judgment Night soundtrack and uh, Onyx and some other bands uh, that kind of uh, mixed uh, rap and metal, uh, Biohazard, you know, bands like that that kind of incorporated that uh, rap style in some of their songs in that period. Uh, I think it was a great period in musical history when those two genres kind of came together. So, uh, 
And then favorite live performance, that would be Suicidal Tendencies. I've seen them three times. Uh, and every time the whole band gives everything they've got, it's an energetic show. Uh, they bring people on stage for different songs. Uh, Mike Murr always has a message. It's always a positive message in the middle of the concert. So I've always appreciated uh, that about Suicidal is, you know, for a band to have a name like Suicidal, but to be so upbeat and positive, it's kind of. It's kind of weird for a lot of folks, but uh, I dig it. So so that is my entry into the contest, man. I hope you like it, uh, and uh, let me know what you think. Uh, like I say, man, I really dig your channel, uh, and Scott, I think you will continue to grow. And, uh, yeah, very well respected uh, by others in the VC, so uh, keep it up, man. Uh, thanks for doing the contest, and we'll talk to you soon. Farley out. Do you hear my dog snore? He stopped. Maybe you can hear it. <laughs> when you play the video. Finally out.